Hello. In this video, we want to explain to you how to start the motor instantaneously and permanently using two conductors. First, uh, we wire the power circuit, uh, which is similar to the direct power circuit, but a conductor is added. That falls. L1, L2, and L3 are connected directly. One of the conductors works uh, momentarily and the other permanently. We connect L1 conductor K1 to L1 conductor L2 and uh, we connect the L2 conductor K1 to L2 conductor K2 and we connect L3 conductor K1 to L3 conductor K2 the upper part of the conductor is down now, now we will uh, do the lower part of the conductor we connect the L1 conductor K1 to L1 conductor K2 first then uh, we connect L2 conductor K1 to L2 conductor K2 Okay, it's the yellow wire. At last, uh, we connect L3 conductor K1 to L3 conductor K2, as you can see. The power circuit of the panel was done according to the plan. You can see plan in the left of the video. Well, now we do the common circuit. First, we connect the wire from the terminal to one MCB here. Now we connect uh, from two a MCB to the seat of the load control or COM of the load control that we use uh, load control instead of B metal. Now we connect from normally open load control to 11 stop S1. As you can see in the map, this is a red line. Now we connect uh, from 12 stop S1 to 13 start S2. Now we connect the conductor K1 from 14 start S2 to A1. As you can see in the map.
and A2 is connected to zero with a black wire of the right. You can see the black line in the map. Now we have to close 13 and 14 contactors K1 in parallel with 13 and 14 starters S2. And now, now we have to connect 13 starters S2 to 13 contactors K1. Now we have to connect the 14 starters S2 to 14 conductors K1. As you can see on the map, the red lines are complete. Okay, this car line is complete. Now we connect uh, a wire from 12 stop S1 to 13 start S3. Okay, now we connect the wire from uh, 14 starter S3 to A1 conductor K1, K2, I'm sorry, K2. And we connect K2, A2, K2 conductor to zero. As you can see in the map, on the map, uh, this is a wire li black line. At the end, we connect a Pause and zero to the load control as you can see. Well, now I will uh, test the circuit using uh, S2. We activate the uh, motor permanently. Using S3, we activate the motor momentary. I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you for watching this video.